Alright, another day, another tier list. And with CC dropping its seasonal banger, I thought it would be fair to do an Arknights music tier list. For the operator themes. Now, this list took way longer than I thought it would. I had to listen to like 80, 90 plus songs. Now, I'm just gonna say this. I don't think there's a single bad Arknights EP or a bad, or a bad song. Hypergriff just don't miss. This is this list is mostly based on the vibes. Now, let me just shut up and let's get to the list. Now, D tier, like I said, I don't think there's a single bad song. But C, C tier, it just it's all right. C tier is mostly filled of instrumentals, more atmospheric songs. I think they're good. I would give it a one-time listen and then I'm done. At the top of C is Alive because. Usually I'm not a fan of this type of music, but Alive, it just hits different. It, it, it's, I don't know. Maybe it's just the Ark Knights in me. It's really like the shiller, the shilling. I'm just like, ah, it's Ark Knights. I like the song, but it, it, genu it genuinely sounds good. I really like Alive. Plus Christina V on vocals. You can't go wrong. Now we're getting to the good stuff. B tier. B... They're a little, they're just a little better than C, but the vibes just aren't there yet. The Blowjob Brothers, I mean, <laughs> Silver Ash and Gnosis, they're, they're, this is all right, very Disney-esque. But at the top of B, I would give it to a Cold Call. I don't know, I just kind of vibe with it. It's, 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 it sounds like an initial D song. Their Euro beat, I don't know, it, it sounds very unique among the rest of the songs on the list. Alright, now we're getting into peak territory. This is the A tier is is based. I have some instrumentals in this tier, like Thorns theme and Lee's theme. And I guess I'll talk about All Hail Savior. Why is why is alive in C tier but All Hail Savior is in A tier? Listen, bruh. I just think All Hail Savior sounds better than Alive. And then at the top of A. Actually no, before I talk about Crystallize, Aya Alter's theme, Miss You, bruh. This, despite what I think about Aya Alter, I think her theme is pretty good. I just have to sound so good. <sighs> Miss You, ah, it's so nice. It just sounds, it's, it's cute. It's very Aya. Okay, now we can get top. Speaking of cute, a top of A, Crystallize. <sighs> I can't play much of this song because I'll get sniped by the copyright police, but I just love Crystallize. It's so cute. The music video for it, with Cowsit, Doctor, and Amiya, and then Rosmontis on stage. <sighs> so cute. Ugh. And it just... <laughs> it sounds so good. You know what I mean, I say? Ugh, pe peak voice actor. Arch Archito. Your, 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 your theme at, in C tier is pretty dog water. Voice, top tier voice actor. Singing Rosmontis' song. Oof. <laughs> Now, S tier. We are there. We move. S tier is songs that I just, I'm always listening to on my free time. At the at, at the bottom, I would put Bluish Light. I just love Lumen's theme. I love Lumen as a character, and Bluish Light. It just fits him very nicely. It sounds so beautiful. So it sounds so pretty. I could just imagine Lumen just singing it. Ugh. So goddamn beautiful, bro. And then right above Bluish Light, I would give it to the Neural family. And Sheath and Radiant, oh my god. Those songs are, are two completely different songs, but it, it matches their characters nicely. Like, I love the lyrics for both Radiant and Unsheath. They just, it's just, it's just so good. It, it's peak. This is peak. This is a peak. Alright, next up is one of the newer 
EPs that will be released in the near future. Missy, Swire Alters theme. Ugh, I don't understand a goddamn thing about the lyrics in that song. I, I haven't seen any translations for it in, uh, at all. But goddamn, I just... Ugh. The vibes are nice. The lyrics sound nice. The vocals are nice. I just... And I love Swire. No bias as a Swire sim. There's no bias, I swear to god. S, S tier is mostly for characters that it just fits their character. The lyrics, that's that's basically what I base it on. And, it, and of, of course, the vibes. It's, the vibes are there. The S tier is my vibes. Right after Missy, I would put Awaken, Spectre Altered. Like, again, it sounds like a Disney princess song, but it sounds so good. I just love the lyrics, and I, sometimes when I, I'm like playing a game, and I'm listening to Awaken, ooh, it just sounds, oh, it just gets me so fired up. I, I just, it's so good. I love Awaken. Very good, very good contender for S tier. Alright, next up, After Awaken. Again, no bias because I love Croissant and Angelina. I just love I just love listening to auto moods. It's it's when I'm driving in the car, it's it's just a nice tune to have, making me it makes me feel relaxed. It makes me feel happy. It definitely feels like auto. Alright. Next after Autumn Moods, I didn't, I, this is where it starts to get hard. I don't think, I, I don't think Eternal Flame should be this low on this list, but comparing it to the, all the other, all the other songs that I'm about to talk about, Eternal Flame, oh my god, it, 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 this song is so good. C tier was mostly for atmospheric music and instrumentals, but it still gave you a sense of the characters, for most of them anyway. But once once you once you add vocals to them, ooh, sometimes it just hits different. The top of C tier had a couple vocal songs, but I would I they 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 were just kind of meh. They were all right, but Eternal Flame, oof, it hits good. It hit it just hits good. Speaking of hitting good, next up, Boiling Blood. Blaze. Oh. oh, Boiling Blood, I think, what is this? The first EP? I don't know, I don't, I don't think it's the first EP, but Jesus. Boiling Blood goes hard. I just love listening to Boiling Blood. Very, very, it's a, it's a certified banger. I just, oof. It's her personality, very upbeat. Nothing much to say. This shit goes hard. All right, next up, oh, I'll talk about them both. Dormant Craving and Morning Dew. I, I would say the, no, actually, no, there's definitely a bias here. Do I think Morning Dew is better than Dormant Craving? Am, 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 am I just a Mumu simp? I just, even, even the portraits, they're like night and day. They're two completely different characters from the event but they're kind of the same in a way partly because the whole single species thing but anyway that's different the vibes the thematic song oh dormant craving oh, it's, it's it sounds good i love listening to it i love listening to dormant craving but morning dew i love lift i love listening to morning dew when i wake up it's just it's just a good startup song in the morning i love Moo. i do not love hole but goddamn they do these songs sound good All right, next up, Across the Wind. Say what you want about Chen Alter. Yeah, she's a, she's broken as fuck. 
just like Surtur, but you know. Across the Wind though, banger, peak. I love listening to Across the Wind. Ah, it's, it's just, it's very motivating, you know? I don't know if it fits Chetan's character, just wanting to spread your wings and fly. <laughs> Lyrics, you know? And once again, it's the vibes. You just, yeah, you just love listening to it. Well, I do at least. All right, we're reaching into the top fives now. This top five was hard to move around, but I think I did an okay job. Top five, or number five for me, Undertopia was Yomka's theme. I just love listening to Undertopia. I just enjoy listening to it. It's I listen to this song like too many times a day. Sometimes I listen to it when I go to bed. The vocals are nice, music is nice. It fits her character, in my opinion. It fits her character. I love Undertopia so much. <laughs> I love Pozionka so much. There's no bias in this top five, I swear to god. Not because of my favorite operators, I think. I swear to god. Top four, keep the torch, palace. Oh. <laughs> You know, this song, I wouldn't even say it's an instrumental. I don't even know if it fits her character, but holy shit, does it go hard. Keep the Torch, it's 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 the first song you listen to if you click on the official Arknights EP playlist. This song goes crazy good. Oh my god. I don't even know what language is speaking. It's like, I heard, I, I read that was like made of Greek or something. I don't know, I don't give a fuck. It, it just goes hard. Keep the Torch. It's 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 so <laughs> Top three magic theorem Dorothy's theme, you know, I'm saying this as a Dorothy sim. I'm so glad it's this her song is so good I just love this song so much. It just makes me so happy. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's just, it's just a love song. Or a, I think it's, a, I'm pretty sure it's a love song. It's a very romantic song. The lyrics are very romantical, but also kind of nerdy, just like Dorothy. Calm down, calm, 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 calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down. Does it fit her character? I think it does. Is it a banger? Absolutely. Next up, top two, Sentenced, Penance's theme, Penance, Penance, Penance's, Penance's theme, shut up. This song is fucking depressing, man. I love mel melancholic songs, and if a song could fit their character to a T, this is one of them. It's just full of regret, remorse, I just feel sad when I listen to this fucking song. Oh. It makes you just want to sit out in the rain and just think. It's so good. The image of Pennant just standing in the rain of Syracusa, just contemplating. It's so beautiful. The song is just beautiful. I love Sentenced. All of these songs out of the way, now we're at the top. If you you probably already see, figured it out based on the songs that are left. Immutable. Calcet's theme. I don't know, this song, it just speaks to me. Funny. Immutable, right? Cause she can't stop fucking talking. <laughs> I love Calcet's character so much and just her theme. Immutable just fits Callus's character pretty nicely. Some of the lyrics I couldn't really get, 
Maybe it's just me being dumb. Sounds about right because Calcet is the genius. But immutable, I would say it like it just tops everything on the list. And with that, that concludes the Arc my Arc Knights operator theme tier list. I would say I did a it, it, I did a pretty fair job, C quote unquote fair job. They're all bangers in their own right. Everyone has their own taste in music. This is just my taste in music. Fuck you guys. I'm just kidding. But yeah, now that I've vibed my way out for a couple hours now time to get absolutely railed in a uh, risk trying to do a risk 18 so yeah <laughs>